Now Hyman Rosenbaum of Sunrise and other survivors of the Shoah, the Hebrew word for Holocaust, are recording their stories for posterity. Buchenwald, uh, Germany, then Theresienstadt. Theresienstadt. A volunteer camera crew comes to Rosenbaum's home. They're part of the Shoah Foundation, a group founded and bankrolled by the director of Schindler's List, Steven Spielberg. The organization's sole purpose is to record the experiences of Holocaust survivors onto videotape. Rosenbaum spent three hours in front of their camera, sharing memories forever embedded in his mind. Arnon Ben Shlomo of Coral Springs has conducted dozens of these interviews. I've seen how people who haven't talked for 30 years about it with their own family suddenly open up in front of the camera. Many cities have memorials to Holocaust victims, like this one in Miami Beach. As an oral history archive, though, the Shoah Project takes a step beyond memorials to the dead. It tells the stories of the living. You asked me before what I get out of it, and I get optimism. And I believe that at the end of the war, of Second World War, the Nazis lost the war, and evil didn't win. After the war, Rosenbaum found a new beginning, a meaning to life. God bless America, you know, I, uh, God bless America is right. Take care Hyman Rosenbaum is one of nearly 6,000 Holocaust survivors already interviewed by the Shoah Foundation, and thousands more have signed up to share their experiences with the world as well. In Miami, Ari Odzer, NBC6.